Ooh, it's your boy Ryan. Welcome back to the channel for another episode of The Sims 4 Bachelorette Challenge. Subscribe to me, I'm poor. I don't know what to do with this daggone camera and the lighting in my room because not two of my videos have the exact same lighting when it comes to the intro and the outro. Regardless, uh, if there was a song that I could use to dedicate to this part, it would be The Chase by Tanasha. Um, that's all I have to say. Let's get into it. This is my fourth time trying to record this part. Well, the first time it wasn't good. The second time there was a lot of dropped frames like consistently. The third time, which was last night, less yeah. than 12 hours ago. I have recorded two parts and then I realized that my microphone was not on. So this is part number four. The microphone is on. Tap, tap. We're here at the Fern Internet, ca Internet Cafe with Chase today, just having a solo time. It can't be a date because they don't really have that good of a relationship. And I don't know what was said or what happened, but Chase is not here for it. Chase! Stop! This is just starting. Don't you be flirty with me after you've turned down literally everything I've said to you. I will say, she was in her third trimester with all the times we had to restart and everything. So I went in using the MC Command Center mod to get her back into her second trimester. I did see who the father of the baby was. Who is this man? Do you want to take his place? No, you just have a body, that's it. Okay, Chase, listen. No, really, because we brought you out here to get to know you, to speak with you, and every time I've opened my mouth, you have something to say. And it's not even in response to what I'm talking about. You have something sassy and mean and nasty to say. So nasty and so rude. It is not even 8 o'clock in the morning and you're giving us this attitude. What the frick is happening? We don't care about the missing piece. You made the awkward encounter and you're missing out on your own dreams. Because your dreams are standing right in front of you. She pulled out this whole plate of old food from her pocket. Tatiana, I have to question your life decisions. Are you fit to be a mother? Answer that question. I will also announce that for the first time ever, I'm not drinking an alcoholic beverage when recording, partly because it's 10.58 in the morning. I'm drinking a smoothie. <laughs> now listen, I really don't even know if I should spend the time trying to get Chase to be nice to us because, I mean, I'm just angry. At this point in the competition, there are four people here. Eliminations are tomorrow, so it's almost going to be three. We... Uh, Never in the competition should she be fighting, I think, for someone to be nice to her, but definitely not when it's this small amount of people and she has something as important as a baby to worry about. You know what? I'm, I'm done with him. He's giving us three, 35 million mixed signals here. Yeah, girl, go in the mirror and get yourself a pop top. Pull yourself up together by your boot strings or boot straps, whatever you pull yourself up by. Because you, you, you need to get back on it. Get back on your beat. So, Chase is being not only dumb, but also stupid and an idiot. And so, you know, I just said, listen, we're not going to be around you. I'm not, because you're just not going to do that to me. So, we decided to take Ashton then out on this date to the spa, because in the part before that, we spent time with Noel and Oliver at Claire and Paolo's place. So, we're trying to spend time with other people today. Chase didn't want to be bothered. He did not want to be bothered. This is a cute little spa. It is built different though. It is built different much like a Ford or maybe it's a Dodge Ram. I really don't remember what that product is. So this is like the front desk or whatever and then you come in here. Like if we want to go to this part right here, there's no access. So you have to go, you have to go downstairs through the lounge area and everything and then you emerge on the other side of the spa where you have access to everything. It's a very unique kind of situation, and honestly, I'm here for it now that I know what's happening. I swear, Paolo is just... Is he an unpaid extra on this show? Him and Santiago, I I'm telling you, I'm telling y'all. Well, let's just get to know Ashton. Let's start the conversation. I just love how it's too cold for them to get inside the water, but they can put their legs in. What's the difference? I mean, either way, they're going to catch frostbite. So how is one better than the other? Make it make sense to me. She wants to tell three jokes with him. I'm afraid if we tell too many jokes, he's gonna get playful. But we're not trying to get playful, we're trying to get flirty. She's giving this man a massage through the ladder bars. Now I really don't know what kind of contortion he's doing, but he's, he's contusing. 
it's clear that a, a concussion has taken place. We've been on quite a journey with Ashton because at first he was cool and then we got really mad at him. And then he just left no impression and now he's kind of back in good graces. He's really been all around the world and is it going to be worth it for him? Is it going to be worth it for him to have gone through all that with us? Time will tell. Oh, be what? Okay, we can get a pedicure? And you choose the color? What color does she want? I don't know. Mmm. What she want? I, I don't know how to get this. No. What's her skin tone? I, 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 I'm... Let's go purple. Honey, you can eat later. Shut up. Let's see this happen. Who's the there? Um, Kiko, come on now. Massage chair attendant. Kiko, do our nails go off of your phone? Are you serious? I want my money back. She hasn't done anything to our feet. Why? Nothing happened. Did we pay for that? I want to stab her in the face. Oh, okay. I get it. I'm sorry. He's just, they're just soaking their feet. And then that's when she sits down and gets everything done. Okay, you know what? I'm sorry. Kiko, listen, I lost my temper on you. I really did. Because I, this man is always angry. He has never not been upset. I lost my temper on you, Kiko. And I was wrong. And I, I will admit it, babes. You were right. I was incorrect. I haven't done this before in the game. So I don't. See, listen, I don't know. Something about Ashton just being the type that is completely fine and okay with getting a pedicure and he's not, like, worried about his masculinity being threatened. You know, he got this big old fat, thick leg exposed. It's just, I don't know. I just, this is a point for Ashton. This is a point for Ashton. Chase can't even spell point. Wait, why's he here? Chase, nobody summoned you. Why are you here? So we have the group together here at the Stargazer Lounge in San Myshuno. Um, just something to do with the guys since I don't think they've really had any kind of group hangs in quite some time. So, you know, we just want to get some group dynamics going and just go around a little bit. We spent time, of course, with Chase, who was a whore, and Ashton today. I really got the romance up really high with Ashton, and they have a really, sh like, good friendship, so that's really cool. So we want to spend some time talking to Oliver, just seeing what's going on in his life, what's happening there. I do want to test something, though, because I noticed something one of the other times I tried to record this, and I just want to see if it still rings true. Okay, see, so I figured out that anytime Tatiana wants to do anything romantic with Oliver, it's fine, but if Oliver wants to do anything romantic with her, it's not good. Which is upsetting to me and my homegirl because y'all know that I love me some Oliver. I just love her and Noel's dynamic. I don't know. I feel like Noel would really take care of her and she would not have to worry about anything. Noel seems like a man in charge. He knows the answers. You know, you just trust everything and he's going to treat you right. You know, I think I, that, that's what I get from, from Noel. Oliver's like kind of killing it. <laughs> he low key has vocals. You whore. You ruined everything. You know I was taking pictures. Do we want to talk with Chase? He kind of made us upset. He wasn't trying to pick up anything that we were putting down. We're not chasing for anybody's affections anymore. Not at this point in the competition, so he can suck it. Girl, sit down. Stop playing games. Oh, Ashton. <laughs> Baby, what are you doing? <laughs> this is an excellent line for Noel. Um, Oliver's, he's getting a little bit washed out, but this is a great line for Noel. Noel, okay. Everyone's just getting up and walking around and really not having a place to sit except for Noel. Only, Noel's only the one that wants to have a conversation with us. It's fine. It's fine, Noel. Here. Chat us up, babe. Ooh, what's the one? He's gonna come in appearance? You better do it, boy. Noel is someone, I think, who has stepped up and gotten bolder since his time here. The way he's looking at her, it's like he cares about what she's saying. He was, like, completely lost in it. Not her bone, her eyes. I'm so weak. 
I mean, just look at this very spirited conversation they were having on their own. Who are you flirting with? Tip? Tip? Oh no, shut up. I ain't dealing with this anymore. I'm not, I'm no longer dealing with this. Y'all get mad if you want to. Don't bring it to me. We're gonna have to try to have him flirt with her again. What? Touch it down. Wait, don't you? You can't get flirty from that. You didn't want him to do it. You hated it when he did it. Because listen, y'all know that I love Oliver. Unconditionally. But it's gonna be hard for me to, in full conscience, say like, oh yeah, he and Tatiana can be really well good together if she will not let him show affection to her. Why won't she let Oliver love her? As long as she's in control, it is smooth sailing, you know, pretty skies. But as soon as he decides he wants to do something to her, look, we're gonna blow a kiss. Okay, see, she blew a kiss at him. He's gonna blow a kiss back and she's gonna push it out of her face. Just watch. Live in a person. And sing. See? I'm gonna have to. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Let's go ahead and just end it. Call it a dag all night. Um, everyone, go the frick home. Eliminations are gonna be tomorrow. Somebody will be leaving our presents. And it'll be just that. The curious case of Oliver Miller, indeed, because... Thank you for watching. Go and be great. Peace. Maybe I really don't think that, I don't think that a meltdown was necessary, me personally. Okay, stop crying, nothing happened. You are literally flirty. What's, what's the issue, babe?